All right, we're looking at the breaker panel. Um, it's a Murray breaker panel. There's your mount on serial number off of it. Breaker number five, six is that double 40 amp breaker that's turned off right now. All right, we're looking at the outdoor condenser now. With this, we'll be replacing it. Um, we'll be putting a new unit on the ground because that rack is not big enough. We'll cut this rack off the wall. We'll have to build a little bit of a retaining wall and then get a better picture here so you can see that uh, the ground isn't level. So we'll build a retaining wall here about two foot tall um, to set the unit, new unit on a leveling pad. Uh, we'll have to backfill that with rock. Uh, we'll replace the disconnect here, replace the electrical line going to the disconnect. Uh, refrigerant lines are good. We'll just pressure test them and uh, reuse the existing refrigerant lines. Replace the whip going up to the new condenser. Uh, access will be easy. You've got road parking right over here. That should be it. Here's the indoor furnace and coil. Um, what we're going to be replacing here is complete system uh, to do the AC and coil. We're going to leave existing refrigerant lines, just flush them out. We'll leave existing gas lines. Most probably not going to be installing a humidifier so uh, we can remove the existing humidifier and patch of ductwork. Flu line is, or flu is okay, so we'll reuse the existing four inch flu pipe. Uh, return will be okay, we'll reuse existing return. We will put a five inch filter rack in here for the, uh, the uh, homeowner. Here's your mono serial number of the existing coil. That should be it.